Cool Sign. What is going on, my sheep foam? My name is Sub Sheepy, and today we are going to be looking at a picture that is leaked um, of the Call of Duty Ghost Onslaught. Uh, I guess the reveal poster, really. It's from GameStop. Now, it's kind of um far away picture, so I'll have to zoom it out in some of this. Um, I'm just looking at it in uh, Windows Photo Viewer just to see it easier while I talk. So, this is not 100% confirmed, but this looks like... If this is faked, like, holy crap, dude. You are amazing. But I, I, I do not think this is fake. This does not look faked in any way. Um, to me, at least... It looks legit on how, um, you know, they have the, uh, the little pack on the, um, the DLC thing, so you can buy it in-store, digital, or, uh, or a digital copy. So, um, yeah, let's get into it. So the first map, uh, that we see here is called Fog, so it reminds me, it like, it's like a fog, kind of, um, like an area, like, if you don't know, uh, Washington Granite Falls, like these little houses, uh, like with snow on them, like cabins kind of, I guess you could say, but like a, a wet street, you know, it, it's like rainy and just foggy and you can't see very well, so I want to see what they do with the, um, the map, just how it plays out, like if it's going to be a little bit foggy so you can't see as well, like, um, maybe that will be the special thing about the map, maybe like on, um, on, uh, starts with the no, I, I forgot what it's called. The one map where it has the, uh, giant box in the middle and you can get the care package out of the front. That was pretty cool. So the next map is called Bayview. So it is a, uh, it, it, obviously it's a Bayview, you know, um, it is like a dock. It's kind of like a boardwalk on, uh, MW3, that map pack, or not map pack, but that map. Um, it, and then it has a lighthouse in the background and, um, just like some billboards and stuff like that for ads and stuff so that that map's gonna be pretty fun and containment I cannot really tell by the look it looks a lot like um prison break but uh, it looks like there's like some kind of church or something up in the top right and a tree and so maybe it's gonna be like a facility that got broken into that was like testing like some nuclear power plant or something like that so the the last and final map is called ignition now uh, I this kind this map kind of reminds me of Bakara a little bit with the green um uh, vegetation and stuff like that so it has like a uh a water tower I think um I can't tell it's just so ignition I'm thinking a car maybe like gas maybe a gas facility I have no idea what this will be but it's gonna be a map so the thing is as we've heard before and we've seen some linked images we have heard that there will be gun DLCs plural, yes, gun DLCs in the future for all the map packs. So, this gun DLC, or weapon DLC, will be, is called the Maverick AR Sniper Rifle, or the Maverick AR and Sniper Rifle. So, this is one weapon, so Maverick AR and Sniper Rifle. So, I'm curious to th see if this is gonna be turn out, like, maybe, like, a Marksman Rifle, which that would suck, because I do not personally play the Marksman Rifle class, unless, uh, there was some, like, overpowered combination. But, um, I just noticed something in the background that's kind of odd. There's, like, a... I think that's, like, Lightning McQueen or something. I don't know. <laughs> I just noticed something weird in the background. But, uh, this looks like a GameStop store, because it has all those, um, things. So, um, yeah, so, back to the topic. <laughs> um, rambling. So, uh, Maverick AR and Sniper Rifle. So, I'm thinking it might be just a Maverick AR, like, because uh, Maverick makes multiple, multiple different types of weapons. So, it could, uh, actually be a, um... A AR and sniper rifle, but I'm really thinking it looks kind of like a uh, mar marksman rifle or a uh, AR. So I'm pretty sure it's not going to be a sniper rifle. So uh, that kind of leave them uh, leave us to a few conclusions. So the last one, which looks really cool and which I've been expecting and predicted, which I never put in a video, but I just thought you know there's got to be some DLC. This seems like a storyline based something. 
you know, extinction. So, extinction, episode one in Nightfall. So, we had the prologue, or whatever it was called, um, which came with the game. So, now we're getting in DLCs, the episodes, so like episode one, episode two, three, and four. So, we should get uh, overall five episodes, not uh, like counting the first one, but even though it'll be called number four, chapter four, episode four, whatever it's called. So, Nightfall. This looks really sick, and it looks like a brand new alien a little bit. I don't know if that's the same one, but it looks a little bit different from the other ones with, like, two eyes. So, Nightfall is kind of, you know, we could, I think it probably will be nighttime, even though in the very first map it was nighttime. It was kind of, it was... I'm not sure if it was nighttime or it was just the nuclear bomb went off and, um, that it just blocked the sky, or the, um, the, uh, light from the sky. But this actually might be nightfall. It looks like in the background it doesn't have really any color, so it really could be, um, a nightfall. And we could see maybe, like, special aliens come out in the nightfall and, like, like, what this, what at first, the first thing I thought when I saw, um, the, the extinction was Wretch from Gears of War. If you've ever played Gears of War, they're like dog-like creatures. They're kind of, they look a lot like the aliens and they kind of jump and move, like, by jumping a little bit. So they kind of sprint jump. So, um, but it, it reminded me in the first Gears of War when you're going through that, uh, facility, um, I don't remember what it was, but then you find out there's, like, these glowing wretches that blow up. That's what this reminds me of. So if you guys have ever played that game, just kind of a little connection there. So, um, th that is about it in this DLC. You can see, like, all the copyright stuff, um, with the uh, Infinity Ward and all the games under it and the random Lightning McQueen in the background on the right. And then we can see the, um, the DS games in the background and then, um, some stuff up there. So, uh, it looks legit to me. I think it's legit. Uh, you can think it's fake, but we, we have not gotten a DLC for a while. Okay, um... So, it will be coming out on January 28th, so, um, that is actually, uh, somebody has predicted this before, and he predicted, like, almost all the, um, previous Black Ops 2 maps, so, that is, uh, pretty cool. So, um, we will see this on January 28th, and, um, it looks awesome. So, first DLC, Ahoy! How, let's see if it's good or if it's going to be a little, eh, not what we expected. They always make it seem like, oh, fuck, baby, containment, ignition, you know, um, all of that stuff. So yeah, guys, if this video gave you any more information than you didn't know before, which probably it did, you should give it a like. Don't forget to leave that like rating and be an awesome, awesome sheep farm, or, or awesome sheep. <laughs> and, um... You should also subscribe for more of this news and stuff, um, and, uh, Xbox One, PC, I'm gonna try to record some Planet Side 2, I know my DX tour is being really weird, so I might record with Fraps, I don't usually use Fraps, but it, it just might come to a point where I have to for that game, because I have it in windowed mode, so, yeah guys, uh, that's about it, I will see you in the next one, bye. Pump this part.